Hey guys, Ivan here, and in this video we're gonna check what Dorian Yates actually looks like in 2019, 22 years after he retired. I assembled a couple of photos of Dorian from 2019, and we're gonna watch them, we're gonna analyze them a little. So this one right here is earlier this year, from April. Right here he's standing with his son, who didn't really choose the path of professional bodybuilder, but he is working out, he's running a gym, he looks great, the genetics are there, he inherited those from his father. But as you can see, Dorian doesn't look that bad really, I mean, for a almost 60 years old right here, 57 to be precise, and not to offend Dorian in case he actually watches this video. But as you can see, again, he looks pretty decent. The abs are there, basically, he did not get fat around the waist, his stomach looks pretty lean, his arms, his chest and uh, his shoulders are looking pretty good, cows are looking amazing, they're still pretty big, legs are also decent, but his back is looking pretty good, which was always his strongest body part back in his heydays, and you must consider that this guy is actually not even lifting weights, do you even lift bro, not even, all he's doing is yoga, as you can see right here, he's cycling, but no lifting weights, he's not lifting weights at all, as he says, because of uh, many injuries that he suffered in his career, such as tricep tear, shoulder injury, bicep tear, quad tear, hip tear, <laughs> so many tears and so many injuries that he suffered due to his high intensity training. And basically all of his injuries happened when he was prepping for a show and didn't want to take it easy, but he still pushed, he still pushed his training hard. Unlike his successor, Ronnie Coleman, who can't even walk, who is in a wheelchair, who has back surgeries every few months, Dorian is living life to the fullest. I'm pretty sure he never had this much fun in his life, even when he was younger. He is living it. <laughs> and uh, he is definitely physically healthy, so that's something we can also say about his physique. His body is functioning properly. He seems to be one very, very active 57 year old. Which is really odd, I mean, considering all the injuries and comparing him to Ronnie Coleman, you would expect that he would have some consequences, but no. He's just out there having fun, being fit and uh, looking the same way. Once again, you can see it right here, although he is all covered in mud, you can see his physique, you can see the abs, basically. He doesn't look like he never worked out. It's not the case with him even though he doesn't train at all anymore, and he's 57. You can still see a lot of muscle on his physique, you can see the definition, and you can see that he's fit, actually, which he wasn't back when he was 300 pounds in the offseason. So as you can see, he lost some muscle, but he didn't really lose the conditioning, he's still pretty lean, and he didn't lose all the muscle. He doesn't look like he never worked out. He looks like a former bodybuilder. Even here, compared to when standing next to a bunch of young, fit men, he still manages to stand out, in a way. He doesn't look much smaller than them, or fatter, he probably looks leaner than all of them. But no, of course, he's not dwarfing people the way he was doing that back in the day. And look at him here, he looks like a real-life Hulk, or Shrek, or some kind of troll, or something like some kind of a beast, more certainly. Look at the size of his arms and his pretty much the entire body, Jesus, he was huge. Anyways, he says that he doesn't work out at all, he doesn't lift weights, but here is the photo of himself with Dexter Jackson and Chris Cormier, and his arm right here looks pretty good, he might have had a slight arm bump, he might have done a little arm workout, I don't know. Maybe just the lighting, but uh, his arms look uh, a little bit bigger than usual, as you can see. So he may have done a, a little arm workout with his friends. By the way, it's crazy that Dexter was actually competing in the 90s against Dorian. And Dorian retired 22 years ago and Dexter took 4th place in the Mr. Olympia this year. But that's a topic for a different video. Even though he isn't as big as he once was, of course, he's still one fit and happy old man. He also has some conditioning, look at those hamstrings. He may not be lifting weights, but he is riding a bicycle. And he was also known for having amazing legs. So he is maintaining quite some muscle downstairs in the entire lower body department, especially calves and hamstrings. And he's also pretty conditioned, his body fat percent never really went up. And he's one of those guys with crazy, crazy genetics, crazy fast metabolism. So even if he wanted to, I'm sure he would never be able to get fat just 
some food, TRT and some little workout is enough for him to look pretty fit, to keep some of that muscle and a quite good body fat percent. He is definitely not the shadow anymore. He's everywhere now. He's doing the interviews, the podcasts, he's even making movies about himself. He is everywhere now. He's posting a lot of stuff on his social media. And I'm pretty sure that the shadow would never exist if he was competing in today's modern bodybuilding. Because he's a smart guy. He knows what the potential of social media is today. There wasn't such a thing back in the 90s. And now there is. So he's active, very active today. And I'm sure he would have been back then if the things were the same as they are today. This video wraps it up as far as Dorian 2019 physique. But I also wanted to show you this photo right here of himself. In which he looks pretty damn impressive. I mean, the lighting is good and everything. But he definitely looks very good here with these abs and with his conditioning and all this muscle. With that turtle shell back and with that beard. And by being gold, he reminds me a little bit of Master Roshi from Dragon Ball. Even though he's not completely bald, but I'm sure you get the idea. <laughs> yeah, this photo is not from 2019, it's 2017, but he's looking pretty much the same right now. It's only two years, so what does it matter? Anyways, guys, that's gonna do it for this video. If you were wondering what Dorian Yates looks like and you didn't know, now you know. Tell me what you think about his physique now. Tell me what you think about his personality now. He's much different from back then. He's not as silent and uh, as of a shadow as he was He's traveling, he's smoking weed, he's doing all kinds of recreational drugs and he's meeting people all over the world. He's having a lot of fun. He's a very active old man and he looks pretty damn good. So guys, please subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed it. All the best and bye bye.